Hi, this is Chris Rose and Ted Dinsmore with SphereGen Technologies in New Haven, Connecticut, with offices in Zurich, Switzerland, and Pune, India. We are Microsoft Mixed Reality Development Partners, and we're here to talk to you about the release of HoloLens 2. Uh, we often find everybody we speak with excited about the release of the hardware. We, just like them, do not know when that will happen, but we do find ourselves educating many people on the fact that you can begin development for H2 with the current headset and hardware we have and the toolkits that are available to us. That's right. The content and um, creating these applications is one of the key things in making a successful implementation or getting value to your business. The Microsoft Mixed Reality Toolkit, MRTK for short, allows us to do a tremendous amount of the software development for the new hardware uh, on the existing hardware. Um, so take a look at the MRTK. Some things you should look about are the Spectator View, which allows HoloLens to share the same image and 3D models with a iPad or iPhone. Um, and also look at some of the applications that are currently out there. The first such as Dynamics Guides application, which gives a lot of value in training simulation. Um, there's a tremendous amount of value in these applications and in building your own applications, so get started now. Yeah, and that's the main message we wanted to share with you today is that we've already provided solutions for clients in manufacturing, healthcare, mm -hmm. architecture and construction for headset, H1, HoloLens. And if you plan to incorporate H2 into your business in the future, uh, we'd love to talk to you about how you can begin development for that proactively now to be best situated to jumpstart when you do gain access to that headset. So, so for more information on uh, HoloLens 2 or Mixed Reality Toolkit, uh, take a look at our website, surgen.com slash why wait. Thanks for your time. Thanks.